We've all been there. A client supplies a file to be separated and printed, or we find a perfect image online only to discover that a simple spot color vector file has been incorrectly saved as a JPEG, PNG, or a TIFF. Now a job that should have been fast and easy turns into a complex, time-consuming project. Not anymore. Freehand's Separation Studio, along with Corel's Power Trace feature, solves that problem. In this video, I'll focus on solid spot color art files saved in popular formats, such as JPEG, PNG, or TIFFs. PowerTrace will deliver better quality images for images saved at higher resolutions. The files in this video were saved at 300 dpi, which is common for many images downloaded from online art services. Create a new Corel Draw document. Import the file into the document. With the image selected from the Bitmaps menu, choose Outline Trace, High Quality Image, and then Reduce Bitmap. This opens the Power Trace window. This window is filled with many advanced settings to fine tune and get you great results, but for most cases, leaving them set to default will do the job just fine. Click the checkbox labeled Delete Original. This will remove the original image after tracing to avoid the creation of unwanted CMYK separations. I find going to the Colors tab and setting the number of colors to double my press size leaves plenty of room to accurately convert most images. I'll set the color limit to 12 for my six color press. Clicking away in the window gets Corel to refresh. Power Trace will stop when it no longer finds colors. In many cases, it will not produce up to the amount of colors set. Extra colors can be quickly merged in Sep Studio. When a file looks good, you're ready to bring it into Sep Studio. Just save the file as a PDF and open it right up. In Sep Studio, you can make an underbase, choke and spread, set the image print order with press fit, then go directly to print. That's it. That's how you turn an incorrectly saved file into great separations, turning a zero into a hero. Freehand and you, together, we got this.